Kogan Rider. Taken an interest in my strike teams. What are they? Assault and extraction squads. When we need the best, I have Apex. Combat experts who've signed up to defend us. Since you have a front row view of the cluster, I can give you authority to dispatch them. What situations should they handle? Protecting civilian outposts, holding key positions, or just distracting the cat. Authorization complete. Good luck. Kendra's out. In engineering, if you need something. Just like Sir Kesh. I'm picking up something. Sending the nav point for Darpalev. That's where the Moshe's team should be. It used to be an Angaran town. There'll be landing pads and good sight lines for a safe approach. Anomaly on the sensors. Something big, possibly hostile, taking evasive action. Wait! I don't think is. Well, that's something you don't see back home.
bringing us in. I will meet you at Darpalo. I thought I was beautiful. This blows it away. If there's a vault here and it's working, I wonder why it didn't show up on the map in Eos. know about this job this is them the ones from the other galaxy yes Ryder Kiran Dals lead scientist at Darpanev I am honored to meet you as a representative of the Andromeda initiative are all their people this formal I don't think so where's the rest of the team Ryder has experience with remnant we might be able to help their investigations you haven't heard? While the team was exploring the monolith, something went terribly wrong. They were caught in some kind of remnant stasis field, frozen in place, unresponsive. I know how to work remnant tech. I can help you. Ryder has seen a vault and apparently reset it. Somehow. Ocean of fish, one will have gems in its mouth. But if you think the alien can help, I'll set skepticism aside. The monolith is not far from here. See what you can do, but be careful. We don't know what triggered the stasis and it may happen again. I heard the advisory that you'd be out here. You didn't prepare me to meet you. The name's Ryder. I'm with the Andromeda Initiative. They say you want to help us. I wonder what you're prepared to do. I'm ready to prove my people are good allies. A strong statement that doesn't answer my question. My name is Rochelle Veer. I'm an archaeastronomer. I study our ancient cultural records for stellar phenomena. I piece together lost knowledge of ages past. My goal is to find undiscovered colonies we lost contact with, potential allies against the Ket. You think there might be Angara worlds you don't know about? That's what I was trying to learn. Then this happened. I was away when the disaster struck. I thought my home was destroyed, and all my research with it, but I just learned part of the building survived. I'm trying to recover my research data, but the wildlife won't let me near my old home. These house guests, I assume they're of the hungry variety? The structure has become a breeding ground for insects and predators. Too many to face alone. Your work is too important to lose. Let's get it back. I'll provide my home's location. Just recover my research materials from the computer. I'll remain in contact with you by comm. Thank you for this. Wow, her lip syncing was absolutely terrible. It looked like someone was like redubbing her. Looks pretty cool this planet, like I'm I'm impressed with some of it, like definitely. Just need to make little tweaks to improve it. Automated protocols activated. Deploying forward station. Still reminds me of Destiny though. Alright. Oh, 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 oh. Don't do that. Uh, activate.
shop, I can ship, I should sell some of my armor for some stuff. Like the old stuff. Plus, am I carrying all this? Mm. No, I think it's just a load out. How do you press the... I haven't played in this in a few days, so it's still a bit rusty. Should have got, should have got it completed mostly by now, but fell behind on everything. I got two more nights at work, and then be on the lookout for Rokha and Garen fanatic. They hate all aliens and will likely shoot on sight. Charming. And I got this till the 6th, so wait, wait, what day is it? It's the 3rd today. Oh, bloody hell, I've only got 3 days left of this. So, basically, I got 2 days left. Well, if I play all 5 hours of a free time, I'm not. I played that Outriders game a bit. Fine, let's see. Actually, this kind of reminds me of it. around the native flora, okay, everyone? Okay, I've never described a mushroom as pretty, but those are. Oh, the hell is that? I was pressing the outriders button for cover before. I 
hate this switch between mode. I really do. It's so Found them. The researchers caught the stasis field. Exactly where Kieran said they would be. Now you're just gonna find the. You're not gonna find the thing for it. Ah, you do. You should be able to locate these glyphs, Pathfinder. Wonder if I'd get anything on the scanner. We need more of those pictures. Oh, it's I think I've just got trapped there. Oh? Why not? And find one though. You should be able to locate these glyphs, Pathfinder.
Is that how you get the research points? At least I found something. Ah, oh, hardly even worth it. Is it up there? Okay, let's find these glyphs. Okay. Oh, maybe the scientist dude was scattered. You should now be able to interface Pathfinder. Oh, that wasn't obvious. The interface failed, Pathfinder. It appears that was incorrect. of these two glyphs. Interface failed, Pathfinder. It appears that was incorrect. <laughs> what is incorrect? Right. Oh, wait, is it? Uh... Ah, I think it's just opposites. Yeah. So 
Interface failed, uh, Pathfinder. It appears that was incorrect. Screw these puzzles. Too tired for puzzles. Oh god. I think I was already on the right one there.
Jarl's been asking to talk to you. Wait, who's been asking to talk to me? Entering atmosphere, LZ in sight. is looking for you. Scans of the Scourge. All that dark energy twisting and turning on itself. It's splendid. It's dangerous. And that's all I see. A mass of destructive, malevolent tentacles. I can appreciate the colors of a coral snake while recognizing that I wouldn't want to get close. Helios is incredible, isn't it? Not just constructs like the Scourge and the Remnant Vaults. Just all of it, so alien. A constant reminder of the divine intelligence behind all creation. You mean... A god? Yes, I believe in a higher power. I know it's a little odd, but I am a scientist because science brings me closer to something greater than myself. There's something about coming face to face with something wondrous that makes you want to believe. Wow. It's wonderful to meet someone who understands. I've had to justify myself so often. As if having faith in the divine invalidated my work as a scientist. As if this sacred could be diminished by the search for truth. I wasn't questioning your abilities. You never have to justify yourself to me. Thank you. I appreciate you saying that, truly. Now I should probably update the rest of the team with my latest reports. We'll talk later. Entering atmosphere, LZ in sight.
I'm picking up something. Vold is the heart of our war against the Ket. I once took part in an attack on one of their bases. Sounds like fun. It was desperate. We won, but only barely. Okay, bundle up, people. I'll stay on my nice warm ship. Take her down, Kalo. We designated this planet Habitat 6. Original readings suggest that it had a breathable, nitrogen-rich atmosphere and oceans of H2O. I take it that's no longer the case. All H2O in Habitat 6 folds the Angari, is ice. And those oceans, frozen over completely. Oh, there goes the dream of a seaside property. That's a pretty intense blizzard. LZ is on the windward side of the mountain. Conditions are bad. I'm tracking gale force squalls. Get out and push? Very funny, Ryder. Oh, Suvi wasn't kidding about the cold. know anything was here? You wouldn't think anything was here. Keep going, Ryder. Try not to make any sudden movements. You'll probably be watched. At least we're being warned. That's a bright side. Peter, right ahead. I need a minute to defrost. Almost at the base now. Make sure you talk to Commander Anyik when you arrive. Life support is back online. Environmental temperatures are within acceptable limits. Life support at 100%. You're the alien Jarl brought. A possible asset, he says. We've allowed you into our base at his request. I am Anyik Dozil. Remember the name, because if you betray us, I will kill you myself. Be assured that what I do to you will make the stars turn their faces and grow dark. I have no intention of betraying you. Say what you want. It is the hands that reveal true intention. If you wish to prove yourself, be an ally in our fight against the Ket. Despite our best efforts, their growing forces remain a threat to our people. Speak to our lookouts who watch the valley. They'll know where our need is dire. Go now. I have other things to attend to.
Hold. Hostile Hope patrol you. approaching. Wow. I wonder how it works. Do you, you think they're adapted remnant tech? You don't win a war without good organization. Wonder what all the blinky lights are. Looks like supplies aren't getting through to the resistance. We could talk to whoever's in charge of requisitions. Yep, they're staring. Let's try to make a good first impression. But I bro Whoa! Didn't mean to sneak up on you. Your commander said you could show us the valley. Zeke, I don't want to talk to it. You talk to it. Stop it, Beniska. The commander sent word. We knew they were coming. Yeah, we can show you the valley. What are you looking for? Actually, that was a believable response. Because <laughs> I'm like just an alien showing up, you know. Uh, to help Angara. I'm here to help your people. Know anyone who needs it? We've got reports from Hajara about someone trying to rescue a kidnapped family. See those red lights? Hajara. If you're here to help, like the commander says, you could start there. Anything else? Alien facility? What's that alien facility on that mountain over there? That's the Ket Command Center. We have constant eyes on it. What's its purpose? It controls Ket operations on the entire planet. There's always ships coming and going. I came face to face with the Prefect there. Meanest, motherless Visan I ever saw. Even the cats seemed afraid. We don't have much intel on her, though. I know. I'll let you get back to your work. Yeah, you behave. We're watching you. Uh, Tell us we're gonna need the Nomad. Yeah, My that's position. pretty creepy stuff. Deploying forward station. Good luck, Ryder. Automated protocols activated. Deploying forward station. Mining zones have been added to your nav system, Pathfinder. I don't want to mine. Temperature is normal. Not here to bloody mine stuff. Life support is back online. We had to explore. Alright, let's go. Okay, Sam, what's Vold got for us? Cat activity appears to be centered around this large central command post. According to Resistance Intelligence, the base coordinates all Cat military efforts on Vold. And taking it down will cripple their operations. In theory. However, given the trouble the Angara Resistance has had infiltrating the base, it will not be a simple task. I recommend a more cautious approach that starts with the investigation of smaller Cat installations. Any suggestions on how to get on Ephra's good side? Resistance dispatches indicate there is someone in Hojara who needs help. We could visit Tekix, a larger and more established Angara Dar that is nearby. Sounds good. Thanks, Sam. Pathfinder, Vault's temperature range is fixed well below freezing, with pockets of even more severe conditions. This necessitates the use of the Nomad. I advise against prolonged exposure to the cold. Got it. Don't crash the car. Our scans have detected remnant monoliths, which suggests the presence of a vault. And that means we might be able to melt this ice cube. All right, we've got our work cut out for us. Let's get going. So should I just go straight for the vault? If I can find it. Wait, how do you get down there? This must be a way around. The Nomad's got safeties if you drive off this mountain, right? Trust me. Can you even see through this snow? Evidently not. Oh. Ah, okay. Is that a tight squeeze? We're out of the worst of it. Temperature should be manageable now. Oh. Goodbye. Oh, 
Might as well follow the road. I wonder if there's anything good in that kid's salvage. These look pretty cool. Reminds me of something from Fallout or Wolfenstein. Well, that wasn't much salvage out there. Set up camp. Reloading. Yep, that happened. See how long it takes to load. That's good, that's good. I can't remember which drive I got this on. I think it's the one that matches. It's either a standard standard one or it might be the it might be the one that matches the Xbox. Series X. enough level for this area. Well, I can 
be a bit more cautious, I guess. Let's have a look at the skills. Ah, she's got four. Right, let's upgrade theirs. Do them ones get this instead? Ah, oh, no. Is that it? She's only got two skills. Yeah, let's just do that one. Right, what have I got? Zero. Should help. Set up camp over there. Let's check it out. Let's see what happens. Oh, oh. I was doubting that was gonna go past that. God, the nomads crap. Pathfinder, a remnant site is ahead. Defense systems may be active. No. Looks like the cat got here before us. Where there's someone you need to save. Activating automated forward station deployment. I would not like to be lost out here on my own. Whatever you think of it, this is a beautiful planet. This is clouds are really something. Mining zones in this region are available. Pathfinder, I've added them to your nav system. I got some stuff from my loadout, didn't I? See what all my stuff I got. Experience. Not bad, not bad. is falling Pathfinder. Looks like an Angaran settlement. Let's see if someone here needs help. Now I'm thinking about that one job I did. Drilling for Ezo on an ice planet. Someone around here probably knows what that ice is for. Don't think that ice is for slushies. Bad weather for it. I'm reading a normal temperature range, Pathfinder. Ah, the alien. We heard reports. Can't imagine anything here interests you. Why not? I heard this was a research station. I'm always interested in exploratory science. 
I wasn't expecting that. I never heard that about you. Now, is there anything you need from yeah, me? Yeah, I doubt you've heard much about us. What are you doing with this giant block of ice? That was cut out from below Hajara. We're right above an inland sea, and the ice goes deep. Very deep. Everything under the first layer was perfectly preserved from a time before the Scourge. There's a lot we can learn from the composition of the deeper layers. Microbes, ancient life forms, all untouched by the Scourge. You were saying something about ice talkers? Huh. Don't let anyone hear you. Stupid story that started years ago when Dinor and I were students in Australia. Talk to Dinor. He knows more about how that tale spread. Wait, she's from... what? What? <laughs> I won't disturb your work. Only the cat show does the same courtesy. Eh? That makes no... Like, uh, what are the chances that there's another Australia? That's completely unrelated to the Earth one. Australia. The numbers check out. I, I don't know what else I can do to strengthen my argument. I... And the oh, fact hello. that I have the You're similar that accent. alien everyone's talking about. What can I do for you? You said something about ice talkers? What are those? Oh, that's something of a joke between me, John Lith, and everyone who went to school with us in Australia. One of our classmates was at an old archaeological dig and thought he heard a voice through the ice. Two months later, another group claimed they heard the same thing. An angry voice. What was it? Too much male. That's what Janleth says. Now it's become something of a joke between us. This isn't Haval. You spend too long out there in the dark, you'll get weak, sick, or worse. It's bad. I get it. How do I stay alive? The moment you see sunlight, break cover. Soak up all the rays you can. I'll be a target. Not for long. You'll get a lot from just five minutes of exposure. After that, get back under cover. The human is listening to us. You here to learn survival tips from old Percy? Get down with the sickness. If you go too long without sunlight, do you get sick? Lack of regular exposure puts our bodies under stress. Too much of that. And we're no use to anyone. I have to keep my strength up for the resistance. You sound like an expert, and I'd like to survive. What I can teach wouldn't help. Different biology. Your body can't store a charge. Good luck out there. I'm ready to go, Pussy. Not so fast. You still don't know how to read a weather pattern. I haven't seen many of your kind around here, but I've heard lots about the Pathfinder from my friends on Aya. All good things, I hope. So far. So I'll take a look at your stock. Got plenty of supplies. Alright, how do I sell stuff? Oh, okay. Oh, wow. Yeah. So let's get rid of the There's no point in keeping the original one is there. Let's get some legs and arms. OK, 
Okay, so how many stuff have I got? Let's check if there's anything absolutely worthless. No worst items. Oh, of course you can. Right, let's just compare this trade to get it over with. There was an alien lurking about the place. Don't try to start something. We're all combat trained by the resistance and prepared to die. And try not to disturb our data probes. Our research is valuable, though it may not mean much to you. What's your focus out here? Glacial movement, seismology, climate, anything Aya needs from us. Resources are tight, so our scientists know a bit of everything. That way, we're prepared for anything. Are you in charge here? Lead researcher. Worked as a seismologist on Aya before I volunteered for Hijara. You volunteered? We all did. Aya is fine, but all that green gets boring. I can't speak for the rest, but I came here for the adventure. So far, Vault has lived up to my expectations. Always a new mountain to scale. I'll come back if I need anything. I'll be here. Let's check my power usage there. I'm doing 430 there. I'm detecting below normal temperatures. So basically, I'm doing badly because I didn't use the shop in space, so I need to go back there soon. If I'm, if I'm just going to get my ass whooped. Is that another station? Yeah, it looks, looks like another shop. Hey, dude. What mission should I do? Ah, I'm about to level up as well. Go to the next board station. I wonder if we'll ever see a so-called golden world that won't be complete death to live on. I met your sister on the Nexus. She's really... Chatty, bouncy, irritating. Yeah, I don't know anyone like that. She said you raised her? Well, I tried. She was a handful. What was it? Just couldn't wait to be a mom? Excuse me. Uh, never mind. Oh. Should I expect that? Skip right past these. The 
This isn't how we thought it was gonna go. This is what I get but for playing on the higher difficulty. I get to see a new galaxy. How many people can say that? That's the spirit. I think that's cat tech. Stay alert. Hostiles ahead! Nearing the nav point provided by Soka Esop on Aya. Automated protocols activated. Deploying forward station. Mining zones in this region are available, Pathfinder. I've added them to your nav system. Oh, are these ah yeah their sights so wait that there's a big triangle that must be where the vault is maybe you activate all these to find the vault in the middle yeah, I, I, I forgot how it works <laughs> I didn't I don't even think I bothered to figure out how it works the first time I'm reading a temperature decrease These are like cat Heads up, looks like a cat construct. Detecting local frequency interference. This could be affecting planetary communications. Let's check it out. Love this squad. So this weapon wheel, are these like, oh yeah, the consumables, so I should use them at some point. Oh. about Sam being in on everything we say and do. You do know Sam's listening right now, right? Ugh. Look, the cat set up camp. Ships attached to the mountain? If there's any way we can help the Angara deal with the cat, we're gonna do it. We're gonna get you, you bone faced freaks. How long have the Angara been fighting the cat? Must feel like forever. They're a tough bunch. I hope the Angara know where. That is a big shield. 
That's Janu. The Kent think they'll find some remnant thing there. Our people can't break through that shield. It's controlled from the main command base. Automated protocols activated. Deploying forward station. Mining zones have been added to your nav system, Pathfinder. Environment check. Temperatures are within acceptable parameters. Life support at 100%. Alright, let's do an extraction. You're really easy to tease, you know that? I think. Oh, is that the... Is that the cave I need to go to? Looks like it. PB. Not talking to you. Is that the entrance to the Yeah, it is it. Let's have a look on the ship while I come back. 4,000 is a lot, bloody hell. the med bay all right let's see what I can get nothing 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 great Have a look at mine. I'll just confirm this. Ah, this is where you can see everyone's. Shockwave. Ah, so I think you might have to hold the barrier. Because I've been just, I thought it just activated. Yeah, no, dumb. It's not loading properly, is it? Why are I slow?
Just give them all basically two skills that are mostly fully leveled. Oh, he is so annoying to take along. He just goes, I shot him in the face. Shot him in the face. Of course he did. Mind Korra said a lot as well, like. <sighs> oh, you can auto level. Of course you can. Many weapons, what have I got? Omni Blade. All oh, right, you can deconstruct it. are just destroyed. So don't destroy any mods, just recycle some weapons. I don't think I managed to get any arms did I? Let's try and go get some arms somewhere. Right now. Oh, these are credits, right? No. These where you send them off. Guess you meant to do that, and then you can send another one off. Right. And these just outright cost credits. Right. Wait. Do they cost something else of end credits? Don't get it. <sighs> uh, tender develop, blah blah blah. Can't be asked with any of this. Let's just have a look if I can get some arms. So I can build. Nothing. Yeah. 
Ja, aber. Alright, okay, two percent shields. Can't oh, get all I uh, alloy required. Don't have any of that grade. Okay. So let's go to somewhere that might trade. I'll lend you 30 if you pay me back by tomorrow. Done. Thank you, Subi. Someday I'll find out why you're always strapped for credits. Not really a holiday destination. Anomaly on sensors. Probes launched. Tracking a huge mineral deposit. Alright, maybe I should go back to that planet. Still going through what we got out of the EOS vault. If I can crack this data storage box, it'll help with a personal project back on the Nexus. This is a nice, out of the way place where I can tinker, and I can sleep anywhere. It's not exactly homey, but I like that about it. Not really looking for a home. Oh, but I will help you find everyone a home. While I'm with you, at least. Does your brain ever take a breath? <laughs> Sorry, not really. Even my dreams are in time-lapse. I get it. You want to know who's on your ship, so you're here to figure out what makes me tick, right? Something like that? Sure. Well, I was born in a log cabin on rural Haitiana to simple but loving parents, just trying to... I look forward, not back, writer. Why snooze through my life story? Get to know me out in the field while we're uncovering the mysteries of this galaxy. That's why I'm here. Got tired of yawning back home. Tackling complete strangers in the Milky Way wasn't doing it for you? I think tackling you anywhere would be fun. <gasps> Did I say that out loud? Life won't be boring with you around. I may never yawn again. Maybe you just needed more sleep. We were out for 600 years. A special someone made the trip with me and she woke up a different person. I've slept enough. Ryder, the Milky Way was so... Been there, done that. Even if I hadn't done it, someone had. If there's one thing you should know about me, it's that I live for the unknown. For the never been done. Well, congratulate yourself. No one has ever so successfully dodged my attempts to get to know them. Yes! I'm number one! Buy me a drink sometime. Who knows what will spill out of my mouth. Then again... I need remnant scrap. Remtech, I call it. For projects like the one I mentioned. Which you're gonna love, by the by. Promise to bring me what you scrounge, and I'll submit to all your questions. Remtech, huh? You got it.
So, Jal. So? We haven't had a chance to talk alone. You comfortable in here? I took it. It feels strange to stay with the others. They are, you are, aliens. And you're alien to us. So there, we have something in common. Uh, we can look at it as a place to start. Got it. Perhaps then, if we're all aliens, it's about what kind of alien we are. You had no idea about us, but you signed up to help us anyway. Perhaps it had nothing to do with you. Care to elaborate? I do not. How do you know Moshe Sefa? She's our greatest mind on the Remnant. I was his student. You studied the Remnant too? <laughs> A little. I was terrible. I quit. Or she threw me out. One of those. We're still very close. So, is that your rifle? It is now. It's Ket. With my own modifications. I like to tinker, to get my hands on something and take it apart. That's a skill I know we can use. But I have one request. Please don't take apart my ship. <laughs> You're right. I signed up. Uh, volunteered for this. It's uh, exciting. There's something unique about you. Uneasy, raw, but somehow profound. Face value, that sounds like a compliment. A nice one. It is. Angara feel deeply. We have <laughs> more trouble hiding our emotions than showing them. I should get back to my work. When we have downtime, I'd love to watch your work. Sure. I could show everyone. Um, no. Uh, just us. So we can get to know each other better? Or just share a hobby? Oh. Mm. Of course. Good. Good. Nice place you found. Clean air, plants, helps me think. Something on your mind? <sighs> Maybe. What the hell was that? <sighs> I know that look. It's just my biotics reacting to all this. I don't normally lose it like that. A Huntress should have better control. Huntress? Another term for an Asari commando. I was one, before the initiative. Some things stick, though. Like losing the old man. You were a second in command. Were you friends, too? He was more a mentor than a friend. Prickly old bastard. But I respected that. People treat geniuses like they're made of cut glass. I didn't care how smart he was. I think he liked someone not caring. I know it's not the same, but I'm a good listener. I hope you're as good at being Pathfinder. I said I wouldn't get in the way, and I meant it, but I prepped for years as your father's second. Then he chooses you, an untrained pathfinder, and all this mess to fix? The hell was he thinking? Is this going to be a problem, Cora? I don't want a rival. Just answers. It, it's done. Best I can do now is be your second. Keep your father's mission alive. 
Then maybe we'll all get what we came out here for. You, me, side by side? I like the sound of that. Don't be charming when I'm mad at you. Are you? You're not glowing. Blushing, maybe. Look, there's still the mission. A lot of dreams to fulfill. So what brought you out to Andromeda? Biotics like this. Thinking like an Asari huntress. I never had a place. Best I could be was a useful freak. The initiative was meant to be different. Will be different if this mission succeeds. So I'm seeing it through. It's quiet in here. I can keep the plants watered while I work. First job, see if there's any news on the Asari Ark. If they made it, we could use some Asari expertise. If you want to talk, I'll be here. I mean the t Pathfinder making the rounds. Slumming it, huh? Want to see how the riffraff are making out? Hey, this is the most important part of the ship. Whoa, don't tell me they put someone smart in charge for a change. I am at your command. Just want to see how things are going with the ship. That little stunt into the scourge tested a few of my improvements. Happy to say, they held up. It just feels good to be stretching our wings, you know? Locked in idle too long, you start to drift. People, same as ships. Stuck on the Nexus, gotta say, I was regretting joining the Initiative. Seems like life back there was pretty bleak. Not gonna lie, it sucked. I tend to live the way I work. Kind of feel it, do it. Not a lot of close ties, no real sense of purpose. Figured maybe I'd find my true calling in Andromeda. Then I got here and, oops, I just made a decision there's no turning back from. I was going nuts on that station. You can't know how jazzed I was when you showed up. Happy to be of service. I think you'll see that showing up is only one of my many talents. Is that right? Well, I'll be sure not to blink. I want to see them all. Let me know if I go too fast for you. <laughs> There's no such thing. You just keep pointing this ship wherever you want it to go, and I'll make sure she can get there. Deal? Deal. I guess I'm romancing everyone. <laughs> Let's just check every room. Uh, ladder, I guess. Just want to make sure that I'm not missing anything. Who's down here? Oh, hey, Pathfinder. <gasps> the Pathfinder's there? Let me say hi. Fine, but don't embarrass me. Ryder, this is Sid, my sister. Sid, Ryder. Hope I'm not interrupting something important. Not at all. We were just finishing up. Wait, Ryder, I just wanted to know if... So I know it feels like I just jumped aboard your ship without explanation. I would have done the same just to get off the Nexus. That's not why I came. Sure, I want to explore the galaxy, but I'm really here to work. I know everyone on the crew. Even the actuators Gil prefers for the ship. Better, I know how to get my hands on them. With me around, your crew's going to be at their best. We've been failing for months, Ryder. Now that we have you, we have a chance out here.
Wow, that's some laser focus. Yeah? Was it too much? Some people get intimidated. We need that sort of drive. I just hope I can keep up. You'll keep up. And I promise I won't tell if you don't. I should track down a lead for Gil's actuators. Back channels, you know. We'll chat later? Pathfinder, help me with something? I know, not exactly standard. Gotta make the space comfortable. Plus, the fabric diffuses the charge from an overclocked Omni blade. Not giving up a 6% boost, right? Right, right. What? Never mind. BS for the requisition. So, finally time for that beer? And after two years and a dozen suspensions, I took a lateral promotion out of the force. Being a cop just didn't fit. But crisis response? Digging people out of trouble? That worked. I bet Hustle followed you into a few peace actions. Think about your alliance days much? Tell me about your group. Heavy urban search terrain one? Earth's contribution to a multi-species disaster response unit. HUST-1, but Hustle looks much better on the patch. <laughs> All civilians, retired vets, or shits like me. I was fiercely bearded. Tastes better just thinking about those days. I wanted adventure and mystery at the edge of known space. There was so much to see. Seems like a long time ago. 600 years, give or take. So, Pathfinder. Why Andromeda? That blunt, huh? That blunt. I hoped my Alliance career would lead to adventure. Exploring, hunting dangers in the dark. Didn't happen. Couldn't. But here, everything's new, and I want to see it all. Oh, I don't hear idealist a lot. Everyone's cynical. Back at you, Costa. Why'd you come? I want to say I'm running from my past, but really running from myself. That'd be a great story. But it's bullshit. I had family, friends, a good enough job. Nothing was wrong. I just heard about the initiative, and I believed in it. I believed in a new beginning. Still do. I have to. We're in it. If it all goes wrong, it could feel like we left for no reason. I know why I'm here. A bad start can't change that. I won't let it. In crisis response, I'd focus on essentials. That's you and this team. Pathfinder leads to planets, leads to people. You've got your part covered, you've got this. I'll do my damnedest to help with the rest.
find her too much trouble. Oh, Roshan. Who are you talking to? Kesh, Nexus superintendent, thinks she can boss me around just because she's my granddaughter. Well, welcome to the Tempest. Trouble's what we do. Ha! Ah, I like the way you think, kid. Hmm. Someone somewhere shivered when I said that. Probably Tam. Damn politicians. Is that all you brought? You travel lean when supplies are tight and you're on your own. Everyone's tight on supplies. The Nexus is no exception. You think it's the same as being exiled? Life outside the Nexus ain't exactly friendly. So why did you leave? Staying became impossible. After the mutiny happened, it was either buckle under Tan's rules or start our own colony. Easy choice. Bad consequences all around. Not all Krogan left. Your granddaughter stayed. Good thing she did. Without my Rushan, you wouldn't have had much of a station to tie your ship to. As for me, I'm way more useful out here. Lots to shoot at, for one. Krogan could have made a real difference on the Nexus. Staying under those conditions would have just resulted in another mutiny. We have a much better shot at something good out here. Can't argue with that. You're not Harry. The blue give it away? Habitat 7 was a little more action-packed than Harry bargained for. He decided to spend his retirement years on the Hyperion looking after your sister. He you knows Sarah's the good one. I think you're both trouble. Hold still. Ow! Sorry. I remember you having a gentler touch. Still trying to get my bearings. Thought I'd be waking up colonists not taking care of the Pathfinder. I couldn't be in better hands. I just stabbed you. We all have off days. I always hoped to work in the field, but everything's happening so quickly. Focus on the positive. It helps. I guess this is my opportunity to study alien species firsthand. Getting a cat specimen aboard the Hyperion would be difficult, but here... Uh... What? A cat corpse. For autopsy, I'm, a live subject would be better, but I'm not greedy. Why do you care about the cat? Harry didn't tell you. I'm a specialist in alien anatomy. My thesis on Krogan virility and aggression is what got me in the initiative. I had no idea. I'd love to hear more. Over dinner, maybe? Oh. Um, thing is, Ryder, you're not my type. What's your type? Not a patient. I need to be able to look at you clinically without distractions. Am I distracting? Not nearly as much as you think you are. But we were discussing the cat. An autopsy could teach us potential weaknesses, average lifespan. Right. Just something to think about. Sam. Make sure the Pathfinder eats his vegetables.
Gold Orbit is steady. Anomaly on sensors. Probes launched. I found something. The materials you found were perfect. Hello. I'm in charge of organizing whatever armor supplies we can find for you. Just use the console to take a look through what we have in stock. Ouch. Why am I paying for these? We're short on supplies with everything that's happened, so I'm trading with outside sources. While I'd love to give you everything for free, they don't care for that.
Ryder, could we talk a moment? Sam's been compiling our star charts. The other pilots on the Nexus will have plenty of new trails to follow. You can drop the charts off the next time we're there. Funny. A few months ago, that station was like a war zone. Flying was my only way to escape the chaos. Now it's become a haven, just as it was meant to be. Every good space station needs a big lake. Maybe some fountains. Indeed. Even non-amphibians need a little water. Regardless, the worst threat to the whole initiative is still that monstrosity. You mean the Scourge? I still see it crippling the Nexus in my memories. I had to train other pilots in hazardous flight techniques just to look for food and water. It's a cage that eats good ships and good people. Helios won't be home so long as it's a threat. The Angara live with it, and so can we. And if every one of our colonists was an ace pilot, I wouldn't be worried. If we could somehow neutralize it, or if our ships had defenses against it. Still, that's what we do, isn't it? Find a way where there is none. Just see the Nexus for proof of that. I saw pictures of the vault. Astounding how big it is. And how much of it didn't you see? What if it's way bigger? What's all that space for? Wild remnant parties. What else would you use it for? Well, that's a thought. You don't really think they... Oh, joking. I see. <laughs> Good one. I should get back to things. Sounds good. <laughs> 